So we're just uh, sitting in the office and uh, we're waiting for this lady to talk to me and uh, message me. But I want to backtrack a little bit real quick. When I first got to the vet's office, um, they told me that it could be parvo. And I've been terrified the entire night. I didn't sleep the entire night. Stayed up with her all night long because she was so sick. And when we got there, they were almost completely positive it was going to be parvo. And it went from that to, well, she does have hookworms. And then, at that point, they were like, well, it might, it might be nothing, but we want to do some x-rays. And the veterinarian lady came in and felt on her stomach and said, I feel something really, really bad in there, um, but it doesn't feel very big. So, then I got really terrified, because I've researched things like that happening to my dogs before, because they chew on stupid stuff. They do. And so, whenever they told me that, I started really panicking. I knew I could not afford to do that kind of a, a bill. I was freaking out. Like, my heart was beating at a million miles an hour. And I just feared the worst that I would have to put my dog down. And, and I would have no choice. Because I can take care of my animals, you know. But $2,000 vet visits are just not in my reach I just I just can't um so anyway fast forward to them finding stuff in her stomach they did an x-ray and they said they they want to do surgery and it's going to cost two grand she said if you call this lady she will talk to you and and see if she can help you so she called me back and she was like hey I'm gonna come see you and I said oh okay well we're here at Rinkin you know we're gonna um be here waiting I guess so she comes and she sees us and she says immediately looks at me and looks at my dog and pets the dog and and just looks at me and says I'm gonna help you I'm going to help you take care of your dog. And immediately, the only thing I could do was cry. I cried all day already, but that was the moment that I cried my eyeballs out the most.